guys, in this video we're going to be reviewing the Kamika wireless rechargeable mic system coming up. Thanks so much for checking out this video. Today I have a special treat for you. I am joined by another fellow DJ of mine. This is Skibs. He also runs a YouTube channel. It is 28TSDJ and I'm going to put a link down in the description below. He does a lot of different uh, DJ reviews as well as he does some gig logs and things like that. So be sure to check out his channel. Today we are going to be taking a look and reviewing the Kamika wireless mic system and we'll be telling you more about it here as well as putting it to the test. So Tyler, you recently purchased the Comic-Con mic system. Tell me a little bit about how you plan to use it. So it's a two lapel mic receiver, uh, receiver system. I'm planning to use it to make YouTube videos so I don't have a cord connected to the camera uh, which you're watching on right now. Um, and it's also going to be used for a podcast called Davis Sports Feud. So that's uh, the first reason I'm going to use it for it. And I'm also a mobile DJ, and I think this is going to be a great device for ceremonies. Uh, a, lot of, a lot of ceremonies use lapel mics for amplified audio at a wedding and or for videographers that need that audio from the uh, bride and the groom and the officiant. So that's my reason why I purchased this item. So Tyler, can we take a look at the inside? Oh, yeah. And then open it up. Oh, nice. Magical. Uh, so it's all foam padded, and also the top case I like, is padded. Yeah, that's and it looks like it's everything's funky. got special spots. Yep. So let me take these out of the way real quick. So inside, they already uh, got the cutouts for the receiver and two transmitters. So the receiver has uh, the two antennas. So this is what will receive the audio to go output into a device, and you can also listen to it uh, via headphones or uh, earbuds. It comes with uh, the two mics as well. So you get two lapel mics. You also get a 1 8 jack to XLR, which is very uh, in ha in a handy very when handy. it comes to ceremonies, very especially handy. for me. Yes. It is a rechargeable model. So the rechargeable model comes with uh, two USB chargers. It just plugs in the back like a cell phone. So there are no AA batteries no or AA 9 batteries. Volts. And then it also comes with a 1 8 to 1 8 jack short cord. So instead of using a XLR, you also have a 1 8 jack, so from the receiver pack to a camera. So the whole receiver pack has a little bit of weight to it, but it's all metal casing. This whole entire pack is metal casing, and also both the transmitters, the two lapel mic transmitters, those two are all metal pack, which is really nice. So you could tell this is very durable. It's a very durable receiver and transmitter pack system. We're gonna turn this on. Uh, we're gonna turn this on in a second, but here's the power button here on the left. You have the set button and you'll have up and down buttons. On the very top here, we have the output for the audio. We have an infrared so we can sync them up infrared connection. And we also have a headphone out, output jack. So if we wanted to live listen to what's coming through the receiver, you can do that for both mics or just one mic. We're gonna turn this on, we're gonna hold down the power button for two seconds. So on the, screen, on the receiver screen, you have channel A and channel B EQs and battery indicators. It'll tell you how much battery is left per pack, which is really cool. On group A here, it tells us what channel we have it set to, and group B, so you can tell which channel is set to what. And it also tells you the signal strength of both battery or both transmitter packs, excuse me. And we also have the battery indicator for the receiver we have itself here. And then on the back too, it's also capable for a cold shoe, so it can mount on a camera cold shoe. Or there's also a belt clip pack, which is really cool. You just clip it in on both sides and it can clip into the back of your jacket or the back of your belt on your uh, pants buckle. So in looking at buying microphones, they have one job and it is to sound good. And right now Tyler and I have hooked up the lapel mics uh, we're talking on them right now to give you a sample of what the audio sounds like. We're wirelessly transmitting from our transmitters to the receiver, which is directly connected into the Nikon, Nikon camera. Nikon SLR camera, yep. And you're getting a sample here of the 
sound quality of the audio and now we've had a chance to kind of do a couple of different shoots and test the mics out um, and Tyler what are your thoughts on I'm excited sure. with having lapel mics now especially for using videography and for podcasting too uh, but I'm also going to use it for ceremonies as a DJ because I also do DJ gig logs and review videos like you said earlier but I'm excited to use the lapel mics for this advantage now. Sure. So I'm super excited that not just one lapel mic system, but two. Yeah. Like like news broadcasters yeah. have or out on the field as well. Or event speakers. If, that too. If you're providing audio and you've got multiple speakers that are going to be talking, having the two mics is very useful. Oh, yeah. We're going to take a test outside to check the range. Now, the mic specs say that it will have a range of up to 400 feet. We're going to test that and see if we can actually get 400 feet of space uh, between the transmitter and the receiver. So we're going to do a test here to see how far we can get before cutting out on our mics out in the rain here in Wisconsin. So I'm going to start counting. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 9, 91, 2, 3, 4, 5. Seven, eight, nine, a hundred feet right here. 18, 19, 120, 8, 9, 150. I'm at 150 feet standing out here in the rain on this beautiful day here in Wisconsin. All right, so these are the Comica lapel mics. Jeff did his review first, and now I'm taking a quick review on this. I love this. This is great. I don't have to have any cords, there's no cords. So I'm just going to take a walk. Actually, here, let's do this. We'll start by the camera and start walking. Five, six, seven, eight, thirty-five, forty, and the trees are pouring on me. Okay, so it's kind of I'm under some trees and it's raining, so that could be the dealio. Kind of, I'm kind of happy, but with it saying 300 to 400 feet of distance, might have to reevaluate it. I mean, different areas of locations have different frequencies. So. so, final thoughts on the mics. My first impression is I like the metal casing. They seem very heavy duty. They are. Uh, it's very nice that it comes with the different cables. We noticed a difference when we had this mounted horizontally. Yep. Uh, we seem to get a larger range by yep. tilting it up, and that, I mean, that extended it at least like another 50 feet. You said we got to about 150. 150 feet. The lapel mics have the locking. Yep. So uh, that uh, in case that, you know, it doesn't uh, pull out pull accidentally out. Yeah. if they twist or something. So a big thanks to Tyler for coming over uh, on to Tinker Forward here and helping out with the mic review. Um, make sure you guys head over, check out Tyler's channel. It is 28TSDJ. I'll put a link down in the de description below. You also have a podcast. Yep, I also work with Davis Sports Food. I'm the video editor and I guess marketing guy. There's no official word, but we have a lot of fun talking about uh, sports on a podcast. Hey guys, if this is your first time on Tinker Ford, or maybe you came over from Skib's channel, be sure to subscribe to Tinker Ford. If you liked this video, smash that like button, leave a comment down below. Hey, I appreciate you watching, and we'll see you soon. And on top of it, finally, it has a dead cat. There's a dead cat for you. <laughs> and, what I uh, always wanted. Okay. Breaking news, it's raining. Uh, <laughs> why does it have to rain? So we are outside and we're gonna test the range of the microphone. And look at that, there's a car going by. Let's try that again. You guys head over to Tyler's channel. It is, <laughs> it is 28TSDJ. So let me try that again real quick. Sure. Make sure to subscribe to his channel. So he is 20. <laughs> <laughs> now it does have two uh, antennas. I'll take a walk. I'll take a walk. Do you hit record? I'm recording. Oh! <laughs>